Hello everyone, my name is Sir Spooks, and today we'll take a look at 5 scary ghost videos to watch after dark. So, let's begin. A man simply named Curtis published this very eerie YouTube video to his channel on July 6th, 2012, and showcases a terrifying paranormal investigation being conducted by the Michigan Ghost Watchers in a place known as the Waverly Hill Sanatorium, located in Louisville, Kentucky. Right away, you'll notice that the footage is incredibly grainy in nature, but don't worry, because what you're about to witness will definitely make up for the video's picture quality. Have a look and see for yourself. If you thought just one shadow figure would be creepy, then you probably didn't expect there to be multiple shadow people walking the halls of the sanatorium in this video. But as you just saw, that seems to be exactly what happened. And if you think about it, the fact that these figures appeared in a sanatorium makes sense because certainly many people have inhabited the place throughout the years, and inevitably some have died. Are these some of the previous inhabitants lurking around the halls? Is this just a trick of the camera? Let me know what you think down in the comments. On October 21st, 2020, a man on YouTube known as Fred Mercury shared this creepy and unsettling video which seems to show something bizarre in his own house. Throughout the video, Fred takes us on a little tour of his house and begins to explain a creepy situation that he has been experiencing recently. So far, at this point in the footage, we can't really see anything amiss in Fred's house. But that all changes within a matter of seconds, as he begins to continue talking to the camera and walking around his house. Take a look at this. Amigos, son a una 26 de la madrugada y estoy solo, ya van tres veces que me tocan la puerta a mi casa y relativamente pues yo estoy solo, pero pues la verdad es que sí me da miedo. La neta no sé ni qué onda en mi casa y pues sí me da un chingo de miedo. Les juro. No mames, vete a la verga, no, 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 no mames, no mames, no, no, no mames, vete a la verga. No, neta, vete a la verga, vete a la verga. Se acaba de caer esta madre. No, 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 no mames. No, no mames. No, no mames. Even though it was something as simple as a figure coming off of a bookshelf and a door closing on its own, it is certainly all the evidence you would need to want to get out of your house immediately. And by the looks of it, Fred did seem legitimately scared as he quickly moved away from the scene as soon as he noticed what happened directly in front of him. Because this video was uploaded not even a full month ago, Fred has not uploaded any sort of follow-up video with any updates. But hopefully he does, because this is the type of video that definitely needs an explanation. Hollywood Ghost Hunters are a group of paranormal investigators that are well known for exploring various different supposedly haunted and creepy places, to see if the legends are true. In one particular investigation, the crew explored a house that was said to be haunted, but it wasn't just any house, it was allegedly the house that was next door to the Manson murder house. In the video we can see what looks to be some sort of hallway inside the creepy house which has all the lights off and is so quiet you could hear a pin drop inside. This is yet another instance in which the paranormal investigators didn't actually see anything strange while at the location, but noticed something after reviewing the footage later on. Let's have a look and see what was captured that day.
the apparition moves at a fast speed, but if you slow the footage down just a little bit, you will notice some sort of small ghost-like figure move by the camera into the next room, disappearing off camera instantly. To this day, it is unknown as to what this strange figure was. Was it a ghostly apparition, a trick of the camera? We may never know for sure. Prosperity School is located in Prosperity, Missouri, and is said to house some strange paranormal activity inside. The school used to be a place of learning for many students in the small town, but since its abandonment, it is now a place seemingly inhabited by eerie spirits, as this YouTube video by user Jupiter71 suggests. Let's take a look and see what was captured in this particular piece of footage. This is definitely one of the more interesting pieces of paranormal footage I have seen in quite a long time. Not only can we see what looks to be a ghostly boy in the school, but some people even point out that it looks like the spirit might be sitting on the chair as well. After a few seconds though, the figure seemingly vanishes from sight just in the snap of a finger. This is definitely a short video, but the fact that we can see what looks to be a ghostly boy moving around in this abandoned school is very unsettling. We have already talked about it for our number 5 entry at the beginning of today's video, but the fact that this last video takes place at the Waverly Hills Sanatorium just goes to show you that the place is truly haunted and is full of spirits who seem to be roaming the halls. This particular footage was uploaded by the YouTube channel Scream Paranormal in August of 2013 and sees the crew exploring the second floor of the sanatorium. The crew states in the title card at the start of the video that at the time, nobody saw anything while exploring the area that day. However, after getting back and reviewing the footage, they were shocked when they noticed this. Did you see it? If not, I don't really blame you as you have to know exactly where you are looking and also, the figure is definitely hard to see in general. But if you look at the end of the hallway, you should be able to make out what appears to be some sort of full body apparition walking into frame before disappearing completely. Although this video is several years old, we still don't have any concrete explanation as to what this strange figure was, or whether or not this footage is authentic. But what do you think? Is this a real paranormal entity roaming the halls of the sanatorium? Do you think it's just a person that happened to be there at the same time as the camera crew? Be sure to leave all your ideas in the comments. And that was 5 scary ghost videos to watch after dark. 
I hope you enjoyed the video, and if you did, then subscribe for more scary content. My name is Sir Spooks, and I'll see you all in the next video. Eat.